everyone, it's Jacqueline. Welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, subscribe because I post a new video every single week. Before we start this video, I just wanted to shout out my cousin's new merchandise. She's always been a fan of graphic designing and she finally made her first t-shirt and I am in love with the design. She gave one to me for my birthday and here's what it looks like. It's just a black t-shirt and then it has her own original design. She did this all by herself. She drew it. I can't believe it. I'm so impressed by her work and it just looks so bomb. The material is really soft and I believe I got a size small in the women's t-shirt and it fits perfectly. It fits like a glove. I just wanted to shout her out. If you guys want to get your own, you can go right here to this website or you can click the link down below in my description. Not only can you get the shirt in a t-shirt, but you can also get it in a hoodie. So please guys go support my cousin and get one of these. I promise you, you won't regret it. Okay, so now for the video. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, I did ask you guys what you guys wanted to see for this week because I really wanted to do a TikTok trend that had to do with outfits, but I couldn't choose which one to do yet. So I did do a poll between the outfits as nicknames and the outfits as emojis, and the winner was the emojis. And because I'm extra, I didn't do five emojis. I didn't do 10 emojis. I didn't even do 15 emojis. I did 16 emojis because I wanted to give you guys as much content as I could. Go bigger go home. So let's get started. Okay, so here are the emojis that I picked out. The diamond, the red wine glass, the teddy bear, the sun with the cloud, the tree, a donut, the purple devil, a lollipop, a bubble bath, the bow, a cheetah, the fire emoji, the sunglasses, a honey jar, the shell, and cherries. <sighs> Okay, so now I had to pick out an outfit for each emoji, which meant I had to pick out 16 outfits. So I knew that putting on 16 outfits and doing a TikTok was gonna take forever if I did not coordinate it right, especially when it came to my hair. My room is a mess right now and it looks so unorganized, but I promise you everything is right where it needs to be. So, except for this, I don't know why these are here. So I have all of the shoes that I could wear for each outfit. I think I'm just gonna wing it and just put on any shoes that go with it. And then here are all of my outfits. It's all laid out. That way it's just here and ready to go. I can just grab it. And then over here is just anything I would need to add, such as like accessories. To film the TikTok, I'm gonna be putting my phone right here. And this is kind of unfortunate because this is the only stand I have. So I'm not sure where I'm gonna put my camera yet. Okay, so now we are going to go over to the TikTok. And the sound that I'm using is the new song by Cardi B, It's Up. It's just very upbeat and I think it works perfectly for this kind of video. I put all of the emojis that I wanted to do in order for my TikTok. And then based on each emoji, I did put a hairstyle that I wanted to do. That way I can put all those same hairstyles in a group together and I can record them within those groups in order. So let's start with group number one, which is when my hair was straight. Anyway, the emojis that I put as straight hair are four. It is the diamond emoji, the sun emoji, the bow emoji, and the glasses emoji. For the diamond emoji, I'm gonna be wearing this new dress I got at Windsor. This is the sun and the cloud emoji. Here's the bow emoji. I'm gonna try to put this into a bow. It's just from my robe. I don't know if it's gonna work. It might be too thick. And then here is the sunglasses emoji. I have my mom's sunglasses right here. All right, here's the diamond one. I'm not sure if I should keep this. I feel like it kind of adds a little something to it, but this looks a little too plain. So I think I'm just gonna go halfway and just kind of put it down there. And then since the emoji is diamonds, I'm gonna put on some little like diamond earrings. They're not real, but they sparkle and they're cute. Here they are. Okay, so here's diamonds. Oh my God, <laughs> I forgot to take my necklace off. What I'm wearing is the cloud or the sun and the cloud emoji so i just have a yellow sweater and then i have white shorts can't really see and then i have white sneakers so here's what it looks like all together i think i did pretty good with this emoji i think all of these pieces really worked all together okay so here is the bow emoji um i kind of like it how it is and i don't think i want to put this in my hair because it's a little too thick but i'm gonna try to see what i can do maybe i can put it around my waist i don't know we'll see I don't know how this is gonna it's gonna look so stupid, but we're gonna try. It looks like I'm gonna go take a shower. This looks stupid. Hold on, you guys need to see it from the TikTok view. Like, look at that. I'm like, oh, I'm the bow emoji, you can totally tell. We're gonna see if this works better. Okay, yeah, this looks better. I Thank God I didn't do the other one. That looked really stupid. <laughs> 
right, so here is the sunglasses. I'm gonna be wearing this big coat and it's not complete if we don't have the glasses on. Oh my God, it looks like I'm on a secret mission and I can't let anybody know it's me. So I'm just wearing my mom's coat with a black tank top under my black jeans and then I have my long boots. Now we're gonna move on to the second category and that's when my hair was in a ponytail. So the emojis that I have for the ponytails, there's only two, which I'm surprised, I thought there was way more, is the red wine glass and the fire emoji. Here's a red dress and a black fur coat for the wine emoji. And I know I didn't go all out on the fire emoji and it should have been the fierce one, but I honestly didn't have anything orange and this was like the closest I could find, but I really wanted to do that emoji. So I just have a simple outfit for this one. Okay, I swear these heels, I cannot walk in them. I'm literally like walking like this. Here is the red wine glass. And then I have this little fur coat that my mom has, make it look a little more fancy. And then I do have this little red wine glass. Also, I have to put my hair up into a ponytail. Okay, so that's my ponytail and I think I'm gonna use the red scrunchie. There you go. Okay, how do I look? <laughs> sophisticated. Oh, also these are the heels that I'm wearing. I think I did this one really, really good. I really do look like a wine glass. Okay, again, I don't have that many things that are orange, but this is the fire emoji, right? I mean, this is the closest I could get, so. Also, I put the yellow little scrunchie right here, and I'm just wearing the ponytail, very simple. I am also wearing black biker shorts. Well, actually they're leggings, but I literally cut them with my scissors. <laughs> and then I'm not wearing any shoes, but we're not gonna look at that. So here's the final look. Next is category three, and I'll be wearing space buns. Okay, so now we have three emojis for the space buns. We have the teddy bear emoji, the donut emoji, and the cherry emoji. For the teddy bear emoji, I'm wearing a brown dress and a fluffy, fluffy brown sweater. For the donut, I'm just wearing a brown skirt and a brown shirt. And then, I don't know if you guys saw my last video, but I was wearing this cherry sweater. I'm just wearing jeans, a red shirt, and my cherry sweater. I love this dress. This is my mom's dress. And it goes perfectly with my bear emoji. Also, this fits perfectly. And then we have the big fluffy sweater. Yep. That's a bear. Okay, now I have to put my hair into two space buns, which I don't think I'm gonna be good at because I rarely ever do that hairstyle. I think I only did it like one time just for fun. <gasps> okay, now I look like a bear. This is so cute. They look like my ears. Here is the full outfit. We got the dress, it has these little ruffles right here. And then of course we got our big fluffy jacket. Guys, I'm a donut. I think this emoji outfit is my favorite by far. It's so cute, I just feel like a little donut. I feel like it fits very well. Also, I think the space buns put it all together. Here is my whole outfit. We got the brown long sleeve, the brown skirt, and the brown boots. It's just perfect. I don't know what else you could do besides, I don't know, the sprinkles, but I think it looks fine. I like it like this. Okay, we got this bright red shirt, and then to top it off, we're putting on this little cardigan. There, I look like the cherry emoji. Super easy and super simple, yet it did the job. Here's what it looks like all together with the jeans. I think this outfit is really fun, and honestly, I would wear this because it is definitely my style. Category four is just mixed and random hairstyles that I thought of. I think I'm gonna do the pigtails one because my hair is in space buns. So all I have to do is just take out the buns. Okay, so the reason why I chose this emoji is because of course it's simple. You just have to get something cheetah print. So I'm just gonna put this on. And there you go, I'm a cheetah now. I just have to take out these little buns. I think it looks cute like this, but we have too many with buns. Here's the full outfit. Something's going on with this bow, let me fix it. There you go, that's better. Okay, so it is just, of course, this little cheetah shirt blouse. Then I have pretty much the same outfit as the sunglasses emoji because I have my black tank top and my black jeans, but I do have these black combat boots instead of my regular boots. I like this outfit, it looks cute. For the half pigtails, we have the devil emoji, but it's the purple one. So I'm just gonna be wearing this black dress with the purple sweater over. This is the only purple thing I own. 
and I literally just bought it. And then I'm gonna be wearing these fishnet socks, fishnet tights, whatever they're called. This does not feel like me. I know you guys can only see the dress, but trust me, I'll show you later what I mean. So now I'm just gonna put on the purple sweater. Also, my dogs are barking in the background. Now I have to put my hair into half up, half down. So I'm just gonna grab a little tiny piece. Does that work? Okay, I'm just gonna leave it like that because I don't know what else to do with it. Okay, now you see what I mean when I tell you guys this is not me. We have the purple shirt, the black dress underneath, the fishnets, and these black boots, but they have a heel with it. So yeah, I really like how it turned out. I would not wear this in public, but I think I did really good considering I could only work with one piece of clothing because this was the only purple thing I had. Okay, actually, never mind. I did end up putting two little space buns because I feel like it works better for this emoji because it looks like the little horns, you know what I mean? Next, we have half up, half down. And the emoji that we are doing that for is the shell emoji. And I feel like this dress simply by itself just looks like the shell. Okay, my hair looks crazy right now, but I have on the dress and I'm supposed to put my hair up half up, half down. Oh my gosh. Pretty. Okay, here is the entire outfit. Again, no shoes, but here's the dress, and that's pretty much all I'm wearing, so that's all I gotta show you. The hair is actually really cute. Normally, I wouldn't go out like this, but I don't know. I kind of like how I did it this time. So I thought nothing more perfect than this skirt for the lollipop emoji. And finally, we get to use another prop, which is the lollipop. I have my outfit on, now I just need to put my hair into braids. I just want this to be a really, really messy braid. And then we just pull it out so the braid becomes thicker. It literally looks like I'm going on vacation right now. So we have the braid right here. Oh, and I almost forgot. Here it is. We have the white shirt, the skirt that literally looks like the lollipop emoji. You know, I'm actually gonna probably start doing my hair in braids more because I really like this and it's really comfortable and it's a really fast hairstyle to do. Also, here's my lollipop. And then finally, category five is when I'm gonna have my hair curled. Okay, so I have three emojis left, which is the tree, the bubble bath, and the honey jar. I wanted to do all of those with curly hair, so I'm gonna go curl my hair right now. For the tree, I have this shirt, cardigan, and these pants. The bubble bath, I have this fluffy jacket and this blue dress. And the honey one is simple, it's just this yellow dress. My hair is all curled and I actually already have my tree outfit. I just need to put on the cardigan. Also, I have this prop, but I'm not really sure what to do with it. I don't know if I should just like put it in my hair. I don't know what to do with it, but I really want to use it, so. Never mind, I won't use it. Okay, so I got the curly hair, the green shirt, the green cardigan. I got my brown pants as the tree trunk. And just like that, I'm a tree. I actually really like this outfit, like, I might go out like this one time and then people are just gonna think I look like a tree, but that's alright. The bubble bath emoji. Okay, so we have this denim dress and then we have the most perfect sweater for this emoji. I actually chose this emoji because I specifically knew that this would work. And now we look like a bubble bath. So I think I'm just gonna leave my hair like this because I don't want to do anything else to it. Also, this is what the jacket looks like with the dress. The dress goes up to here. So yeah, we're ready to record for the TikTok. Finally, guys, we are at the last emoji, which is the honey emoji. Well, the honey jar. And I'm just wearing a yellow dress. This is my mom's, and I don't know what's going on with the boob area, but I think there's supposed to be like pads right here, but they are all messed up and I tried so hard to fix them and move them around, but it's just not working. So they're just going to look a little lumpy in the video, but I tried my best. So here's what the dress looks like as a whole. And then again, I'm just going to leave my hair like this because I think it looks really pretty and I don't want to change anything. Okay. Last bit of the TikTok. We're going to do this. I don't even want to check the time. It's already kind of getting dark outside. And I started recording this at 3 p.m. So it's been like three hours. I don't know. We are finally done and I just checked the time it's 5 30 I started maybe like at 12 or 1 so this was a good four to five hours for this video and I still have to sit down and talk about this video tomorrow okay guys so it is the next day I did this trend yesterday and let me just tell you it was a journey it took so much time and effort 
but I think it was totally worth it. I love how much all of the outfits corresponded with the emoji that I was trying to look like. I was going to pick my favorite one or the one that looked the most accurate by the end of this video, but honestly, I can't choose. I think they all worked pretty well, and even though there were some that were kind of a little bit off, I would say I did a pretty good job at this challenge. Now, I would love to show you guys the TikTok, and I will, but I cannot put the original music over it because then I'll get copyrighted. So I am going to put some YouTube music in the back, but if you do want to see my original TikTok with the original sound, and I think you should because I was lip singing the song, go check out my TikTok, this is my at, and then there you can see the video. But without further ado, here is my TikTok. Okay guys, that is it for this challenge. Let me know which one you think was the most accurate or which one was just your favorite. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you like this kind of content. These are my favorite videos to film, so you will be seeing more of this. I might do the other TikTok trend. So if you wanna see that, comment down below and let me know. And don't forget to click on the link in the description down below so you can get your own graphic t-shirt by my cousin or sweater. But that is it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you next time. Bye.